has been a lot of research over the last 10 to, to 20 years even about um, that connection between oral health and systemic health. And it's really a connection between periodontal disease or gum disease and oral health because the systemic diseases that are typically brought up as being connected with periodontal disease are heart disease, diabetes, preterm infants, even Alzheimer's disease has been suggested recently, stroke, and multiple others, actually. You'll read a variety of things in the popular press. It's hard to explain this connection because we don't know if there's a cause and effect yet. So if, let's say if you have periodontal disease, does that mean you're more likely to have heart disease or you're more likely to have a preterm infant or you're more likely to have diabetes? Those cause and effect kind of things haven't been worked out. What we do know is that there seems to be an association though that if you have heart disease, people with heart disease seem to be more likely to have gum disease. And why is that? It could be that the same kind of genetic makeup that leads you to have uh, diabetes or heart disease or any of these others, uh, it's the same kind of makeup that leads you to be susceptible to having gum disease. It doesn't necessarily mean one causes the other, but it means that you have the same kind of makeup or the same kind of personal habits. Are you a smoker? If you're a smoker, you're more likely to have periodontal disease, you're more likely to have diabetes, you're more likely to uh, get heart disease. Um, they're all factors, high risk factors for these things. So it, it could just be your personal habits, but studies are able to eliminate all these personal habits and see what's left and they still find that there's some kind of association between people who have gum disease and other diseases.